downloaded the app, you can sign in with your existing Instagram account. Threads will then import your Instagram profile information, including your username, bio, and profile picture. To start using Threads, you'll need to add some friends. You can do this by searching for their usernames or importing your contacts. Once you've added some friends, you can start posting and messaging. To post, just tap the right button in the middle and type in a message. You can also add photos, videos, and stickers to your posts. Let's discuss some important features of threads. Privacy feed. Your threads feed is only visible to the people to your followers. This means that you can post and message without worrying about your posts being seen by everyone. To do this, go to settings, then click on privacy, then click on a private profile if you want to show content to your followers. Hidden words are a feature in threads that allows you to filter out replies to your threads that contain specific words. This can be useful if you want to avoid seeing replies that contain offensive or unwanted language. To add hidden words, go to settings, then click hidden words. You can then enter any words or phrases that you want to filter out. For example, you could add words like spam, scam, or hate speech. Once you've added some hidden words, any replies that contain those words will be hidden from your threads feed. You can still see the replies if you tap on the hidden requests folder in your threads settings. Hidden words are a great way to keep your threads feed clean and free of unwanted content. If you're concerned about seeing offensive or unwanted replies, I recommend adding some hidden words to your settings. Hide likes. To hide likes on threads, go to settings, then click on privacy, then click on hide likes and toggle on hide likes. Once you've done this, the number of likes on your post will be hidden from everyone, including you. To customize your notification settings, tap on settings and scroll down to notifications. You can then choose which types of notifications you want to receive, such as new messages, status updates, and thread replies. Click on the home button and let's discuss what you can do here. You can like someone's post by tapping on the heart. You can reply to the post by tapping on the message button. You can repost someone's post by tapping on this button. Here you will see two options repost and quote. By clicking on the repost button you can repost and by clicking on the quote button you can add your quote to the original post and it will be shown in your profile as well. By clicking on send button five options will appear. Add to story, post to feed, tweet, copy link, and share via. Let's discuss them one by one. You can add thread posts on Instagram story by clicking on add to story. You can post a thread to your Instagram feed by clicking on a post to feed. You can tweet threads as well by clicking on a tweet. You can copy the thread link as well by clicking on copy link. You can share threads and post links on different social media platforms and WhatsApp. Threads is a great way to connect with your closest friends in a more private and personal way.